right y'all so today is sunday so we making sunday dinner i'm gonna do some fried beef ribs we got mac and cheese in the oven we got uh green beans we also got baked beans and we got potato salad but i wanted y'all to see how i season my ribs so i'm gonna use some season salt some tonies some tonies some uh some seasoning 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 salt mortons of course you know some goya some onion powder garlic powder slap your mama and then you know some mustard then we're gonna deep fry these boys and that's dinner so let's get the seasoning You make sure you gotta make sure you season the ribs, like so that it'll be you know seasoned good. But of course, you know I'm I like seasoning all my food. Hey, Maya, she don't know how to cook really. I gotta teach her how to cook. <laughs> she mad. She just heard it. <laughs> The only thing is, I ain't got no gloves, so I hate having to use my hands to mix, you know, all this in, especially with the mustard, but what can you do? I didn't know I ain't had no more gloves, so got to do what I got to do. This is not his favorite seasoning, to slap your mama. She loves this seasoning. She used this on, like, mostly everything she could. Don't be afraid to comment below to let us know what you guys cooked on Sunday. Make sure you share, like, uh, hit that bell for more content. Subscribe to the channel. So I'm about to mix this up and I'll come back later when I'm about to fry them in a the deep fryer so y'all got so you guys can see how they look and all that. All right, y'all, so now that I mixed it all up, this is how they came out. I got all the seasoning. I got the mustard on there. So I'm going to let these sit in the refrigerator for like 30 minutes just so, you know, the seasoning can, you know, can do this what it does. And then I'm going to come back when I'm ready to fry these bad boys and let y'all see the finishing touch. All right, y'all, I got the ribs in there so I'm about to drop them down on in there and let them cook Ooh, look at that there and then I'm gonna come back let y'all see the finishing touch of them when I take them out the deep fryer 